Hello, everybody, and welcome back to Crusader Kings 2 Multiplayer Edition. As always, I am joined by both Northern Lion and Arumba. How's it going, fellas? Hello. Hello, and welcome. We are, I am in the middle of getting crushed by Navara. And I am I'm, coming in. You can see 8,000 men here. And I am good to go when you guys are, so let's do this. Same here. 8,000 well-trained Scumtopians. Scumtopians. In. You changed the name to, name to Scumtopia. Every time I take over a province, I have to change my name to reflect the new culture of my populace. Ah, ah okay, gotcha. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I don't even know where my troops went. Apparently, they're just gone. I think you, they might have wiped you out completely. That's that, Yeah, probably. Oh, that's rough. Ah, uh, you, you're going to be fine. Again, yeah, you've got a thousand men. I mean, you've got a pretty good sized army. Yeah, right. The, the, the Middle Kingdom is a great name. Well, I'm right in the middle between you guys. So, <laughs> <laughs> are you you're you declared war on Navarra, right? He did. Yeah. Okay. Me? Yeah, he, I declared he, war on Navarra. I right. thought it was going to go well. Apparently, I was wrong. Well, I will. Uh, I'll continue the siege. That's the good thing. Like we are giving ourselves a seriously unfair advantage here. True. And I like Very it a true. lot. I need to get, while, while my war is being lost, I'm going to go ahead and see if I can get married somewhere. Yeah, I mean, you, so. you, got, you just sit back and relax, baby. Scumtopia's got this under control. Probably. Oh, who's this guy? Prince Arumba oh, of Middle oh. Kingdom. Omoravids have just gotten called into the war again. Some jerks. You're, you're still at war? Well, yeah. Oh, you're taking Granada here. I didn't even notice. Oh man, you have a four thousand peasant revolt. <laughs> that's Ew. a pretty big. It's not me. It's <laughs> a pretty big peasant revolt. That is I an agree. enormous peasant revolt. Well, I have. It's because I have like six, almost six thousand personal levy. Yeah. Just... So I think it's based off that. I'm not sure, actually. Mathis, it's a lot. I, I captured the the prince of Navarra in oh, the really? first battle. Thank you. I appreciate it. <laughs> wow. No wonder the can, war score flipped. That's, yeah, that's, that's awesome. 36 now. <laughs> Jesus. If I can just uh, capture the king in the next battle, this will be over. That would be great. I guess it's always over, isn't it, if you capture the, the leader of the country. Right? Yeah. Yeah, if you have him in prison. Yeah. Okay, great. So the darn guys are coming down again. So, all right, I'm going to pause because you guys tend to not. <laughs> it, it seriously flashed for a split second. I accepted. I, I have not received one just yet. I can't send you one, apparently, because I, I guess I called you in more recently. Hmm. Well, I, I can still send troops in for the peasant revolt, at least. That's nice. And, yeah, <laughs> take care of that for you. Wait, where'd all your men disappear to? Okay. Because Navarra has no chance of, of coming back from this. Thank goodness. I don't even know how many men I can raise right now. I can raise... <laughs> eh, I can raise a decent amount. Do you think you can raise enough to at least uh, do the sieges, and then I'll... Uh, potentially, let's take a look. Right. Uh, when I get there, I'll let you know. Well, I can always give you like a, a thousand or something, or two thousand if necessary. March my men in and see what what my options here are. Because they're, they're decimated now. They have no force. Hmm. I'm really interested to see, like, if we end up turning on it. Well, okay, oh. when we end up turning on each other. What's going when on? <laughs> second? If we... When we... Hmm. Damn, this army is going to catch catch my army. Oh, God. It's so bad. <laughs> You're I not going down people. without a fight. Yeah. As every time I'm almost about to win a war with these guys, the, the guy down there just is like, oh, I'm going to come help out. I hate these people. Arumba 07. Oh. You heard it here first. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it's true. Um, are you? Can you offer to join the war? Uh, mm -hmm. Let me try. Uh, I need to find you. Wait, that's not... There you are. Offer to... Okay. Nope, there's no offer. Option. It says I've, I've called you to arms in the last five years, so it's not letting me do it again. It seems accurate. Is your siege going, Mathis? My siege is going on the on Navarra's capital, but not the the second one. The second okay. Um, in, in a second, I'll create, like, a. you probably need, like, 500 men or something. Uh, I need a little more than 500, but just about, yeah. Okay. Aruma, do you have the uh, the peasants under control here? Is that what... Yeah, I'm about to, to just help out with that battle so I can try to regain yeah. my entire levy. Because even if I gave you, or, like, I attached my force to yours, I still wouldn't be able to attack the Granadan army, right? And the Almoravids. 
They're showing up as gray to you, right? Yeah. I think I'm going to have to just stall until maybe until that uh, five-year thing is over and I can call you in again. Yeah, w once I can be called in, like, I, I have tons of money so I can hire a bunch of mercenaries and hopefully swing it a little bit. Ideally. And by then, I, you know, maybe Mathis' war with Navarro will be over. Hopefully. And, Ma and Mathis did accept the call, and he's got a couple thousand, so. Yeah. Actually, that's, but, that's uh, a good point. You could give those men to a Roomba, and I'll just... Uh... Oh, you know what you could do? I mean, if you want to be insane, is <laughs> <laughs> declare war on that Almoravid guy. The Almoravids, like, like this enormous well, uh, North Africa. We're going to fight him anyway. Think about it. If we kill his army, he'll have right. no army. And you could take a duchy out of it, and that, that way you'd be hostile to him. I mean, you, if you're going to participate, if you're going to throw your men at the war anyway to help us out, to help me out, then you might as well get something for it. Like, I don't know, man. It seems scary. Like, What's you could it? take uh, take the Duchy of Tangier. Um, let me find duchies here. Duchy of Tangier. Okay, I mean, that does look like some pretty choice real estate, I'll admit. Um, let me think about it. So, okay, let's add up the math. So, I've got 2,000 retinue. I've got... Yeah. 6,700 men that I can raise right this second. Okay. So that's 8,700. I have another you have 63. 63. So 87, 63. Uh, what is 14 that? 14 and a half, 15. Well, I think 700 and 300 is going to be an even thousand. So yeah, like 15,000. Then we got 2,000 more between the Castilian armies of Mathis. I'm, I'll hire some mercenaries as well. So all we have to really fight is that 14K stack. Okay. Yeah, sure. Well, I think we, think we can do it. So, but the only I, way that works is if you actually declare war, because otherwise you're not hostile to him. I can declare like a holy war for Tangiers. Mm-hmm. It's totally okay. a good idea. You're, I, <laughs> I don't trust you because of that tone of voice, but it's I'm a willing, great idea. I'm willing to throw myself into some dumb wars. I can't declare war on him because I have army levies raised. All right. Yeah, you got to retreat back to your own land. Uh, don't disband mercenaries if you have them. Right, I don't think I have any yet. Um, but uh, sure, I'll, I'll send my man back, and we'll do that, and that'll be silly and hopefully work. Plus, it, it, I just gained I just gained a lot more men too. And now I have like altogether, if my levies weren't depleted, I'd have eleven and a half thousand, just not even including the retinue. How's, how's so, your siege going in Navarra, Mathis? Uh, I still I'm still sieging the capital, but I still can't siege the uh, mm. secondary holding we have. What's your gold situation like? Um, minimal, not okay. <laughs> a lot. Okay. I have 64 gold. I was <laughs> I was briefly thinking that I would like send you a gift and you could hire mercenaries to do the siege while we were fighting. No, it's not, no, it's not worth it. Don't worry yeah. about it. I mean, as soon as I have this place, we, we'll be fine. He'll hate me, but whatever. Oh, yeah, whatever. I lost 50 prestige because he's my kinsman and I declared war on him. How much prestige do you have? With this guy, 255. Negative 50? Oh, yeah. <laughs> no, I married a countess, so I got a little prestige out of that. Hmm. Pretty sure I don't want to accidentally maim my son. So, uh. Sure, that my son's. Pretty... Oh no, my son's craven. Really? Yeah. Okay, so I'll, I'll declare war on him now. Is this. Okay. Okay, yep. let's. Uh, get this done. Let's check, check the math again. I've got, um. 6,400 6, plus 2. So 8,400. Okay. I will be raising, uh. About 7,000 plus at least another 3,000. Okay, Is and I have I have money for mercenaries, but I, I have a loan that I have to pay, so I might not. I mean, sure. I'd, I'd rather not have to I'll, use the money for. That, but I'll be honest right now, I'm I'm flush, so it might be in my best interest to get uh, maybe even two mercenaries. You have a thousand gold. What have you been doing? <laughs> you have a thousand gold. What? You save save for a rainy day, man. Jeez. Well, you didn't do much last video, so I guess that's maybe what you've been doing. Just been sitting on your money. Precisely. Yes. Okay. You're, you're like uh, you're like that duck. Scrooge McDuck, yeah. Is he the no, not that one, the one that swims in the money. Yeah, that's That's Scrooge McDuck. I thought Scrooge was like uh Yeah, he's the cranky rich duck. Yeah. Is it Scrooge McDuck in DuckTales? Just because yep. he's cranky doesn't okay. mean he doesn't okay. enjoy a good soak. I was thinking of um I was thinking of the other guy, the uh I don't know. Dar Darkwing Duck. <laughs> no. Darkwing Duck! But I All did right. watch that show. I have declared war. Hey, Mathis, you want to join my holy war for Tangiers? Of course. <laughs> uh <laughs> All right, let's let's hire this then. You guys, also, are, gonna, you guys are gonna have sure. all the land. I'm gonna have no land. I think the Byzantines might actually join me. Are you that that would be in? amazing. I've got a pretty good relationship with them. Can I call the papacy into war here? Where should we meet? Oh God, they're coming. Well, the game's paused. 
<laughs> oh, oh, thank God. Uh, do, <laughs> seriously, though, what you mean? <laughs> no, they're go- oh, they're, they're going backwards. Okay. Oh, God. We're fine, then. We're fine. Um, I'm going to go to, uh, let's see, Badajoz has like 23K supply limit, so it's safe to go there, but it's really close to where they are. I'm going to rally back to like Salamanca. Okay, I will send my men there. Hungary's gone. Hungary? Whoa, I don't, they, Humania oh, ate Jesus. Them up. <laughs> where did that like, come what's from? What's happening over in the Byzantine Empire? <laughs> Where's Hungary? The, the <laughs> so, Tengri listen. faith was reformed too, wasn't it? Like, yeah, the gotta, Tengri faith had been reformed. It said we got to pop up for that at some point. That's uh, terrifying. Oh my God, the Byzantine man is uh, or the leader is blinded and horrifying looking. Okay, I can't call the Byzantines into, into war, but I'm good to go. I think. Okay, my my son in one year is betrothed to marry the princess of the Holy Roman Empire, so oh, maybe man. in a year we can call them in. I don't like that you have that relationship on the go. <laughs> <laughs> they have 95,000 troops, Jeez. so that might work out for us. I should start improving relations with him, actually. I should send him a gift. I don't like that at all. <laughs> okay, you guys ready to go? <laughs> yeah, go for yeah, it. Yeah, sure. Okay, good luck. Let's see how this goes. You declared right. the war, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And um, my men are just walking back to Salamanca now. Okay, between the two of our armies, if we crush that 12,000, that 12, then, then it's over. Okay. There's like nothing oh, they can do. Good. My son is content and craven. I'm very <laughs> glad that I uh, chose to educate him myself. <laughs> it's very important that we end the wars, like, that either we both end the war at the same time or like don't do it early. Like, let me know if you're going to end your war. Sure. And don't siege the counties that I need, otherwise I can't take them. Acceptable. I Well, the same to you, man. <laughs> I, I what I'm gonna do. My plan is to help you crush that big, huge stack, and then I'm just gonna go take my little two counties in in Granada. And then or? once, yeah, and then once I end my war, you'll be able to call me into yours. Okay, that that's acceptable then. I'm a little concerned. I'm not sure I want to necessarily have this land at the forefront of North Africa. Why not? Uh, do, do, have you seen North Africa? Do you, have you seen the income of those provinces? <laughs> uh, what, in EU four, I guess I have at least, but. Tangier makes 85 gold a year on its own. That's pretty good. But this is not the Reconquista anymore. We're not the we're not uh, retaking our land. We're now being we're aggressively pushing into the enemy land. Yeah. <laughs> great. It's great. <laughs> That's what we want to do, right? The only reason I'm doing this is because because I said I, it was a good idea. Exactly, you yes. Have, you have 12,000 men on your own. Um, right, so hey, just, uh, King Math is the first. Well, I'm just trying to help you out. Why don't, are you trying to? Don't don't kill my heir. You don't. He's not your heir. Wait a minute. Yeah. I'm oh, you're to kill right. The he's not. One. Oh, thank you. Yeah, sure. By all means, spy master. Keep what doing. It. What are you doing? All right. All right. So you should. Yeah. Combine your army and then either attach it. Uh, or... how do, is there a t- an attach button? Yeah, it's oh. in the top left. Yep, yeah. The little chain fence. Thing. Are you Done. are you aware of who you're marrying your betrothed uh, your son to there? Ryan? Yeah, he's marrying the princess of Ethiopia. The Duchess of Axum. Yeah. Axum. Exactly. That's in, that's in BFE. What does that mean? You don't know what BFE means. It's literally in BFE. Big fucking Ethiopia. <laughs> yeah, it's it's not it's it's uh <laughs> no, <it's, laughs> I can't say it. I just can't. <laughs> All right. Hey, I don't know. Is it actually like very offensive? I didn't mean to to it's, go it's into but, it. It's but but in Egypt. That's what it stands oh, for. Oh, okay. And it's literally in Egypt, like over there by accident. Yeah, sure. Not not actually Egypt, but by all means. It's a phrase that just means really far away. Yeah, they're gonna send all of their Ethiopian geniuses over here. Probably. I just pulled out a huge chunk of people out of it and put them in my dungeon. Thank you. Where I don't actually know where that where'd that army go. Yeah, where it are we just, supposed to fight these people? Well, ideally, we're going to hang out... Uh, yeah, Hashashin um, is Agaceros. I think I just married my son off matrilineally. Did you, are you serious? <laughs> Did you really? You accepted it? No, I it's think, regular marriage. It, I thought it said matrilineally. No, you did it. You did it the right way. Oh, it's thank regular. God. Regular. Oh, Jesus. Because I sent them a request to do it uh, regularly, and then they sent me one to do it matrilineally. They must have accepted mine. Mm-hmm. I hate how the AI can even try to do that. Yeah, so we'll just hang out in uh, Algaceras with the majority of the army, and if they feel like crossing the, the straight, then you know, that's sm- dumb. Smack them down. Do they get a huge penalty for that? Oh, huge. Yeah, it's worse than almost... It's like one of the worst penalties you can get. Okay. So... All right, so they got 15,000 there. I just pause it for just a second. Yeah, um, yeah. 
we we don't want to cross it to fight them. Mm -hmm. Tangier and Septa are both <clears throat> planes, so we we could, if we wanted to take the fight to them, cross to Septa and then just go attack them in Tangier. How, how many men do we have total in this deck? I can only, okay, I can only see twelve. Um, because you catch me, I, I get the whole yeah, number yeah. twenty-one. Uh, do you think that's enough? Twenty-one versus fifteen is very very good, but generally, you know, you want overwhelming force so that they yeah. can't actually rally. Oh, something just crashed. Uh oh. What? Looks like my uh, my CK2 just crashed. Oh no! Okay, well I'm gonna have to uh, wrap my video up here. So, um, hmm. Well, we'll just. I guess. Uh, yeah. <laughs> we'll I'll just do an outro. Yeah. <laughs> all right. Well, thank you guys for watching. I appreciate it. All the links to the other two will be in the description below. Make sure you hit the subscribe button and like and comment if you enjoyed the video. And as always, I'll see you next time. Later. <laughs>